works right there. Man, that is fabulous. You can do it. You just gotta you gotta make the decision and you have to plug into the ways of doing things. You have to submit yourself to a different way of operating. And when you do that, it changes everything for you. It's a, it's a big, big shift. Justin follows me on Twitter, at Dave Ramsey. About 800,000 of you do. If I have an emergency and baby step four, do I stop the investing again to rebuild my emergency fund? If you cannot rebuild it very, very quickly, yes. If it's a small amount or your income and everything is such that you can go ahead and rebuild it and keep doing your 15% of your income into retirement, then uh, you know, that's fine. I, you know, jumping in and out of a 401k is just kind of a lot of administrative nightmarish stuff. But, um, you know, let's say that you had a $20,000 emergency fund and you hit it for an emergency for $3,000. No, I would not stop my 401k. I would rebuild it. Uh, let's say you had a $12,000 emergency fund and you hit it for $10,000 probably stopping the 401k because you're down low enough that I'm scared now and I want that emergency fund in place before you make big moves uh, on, on out into things and for sure before you put extra money into your home or something like that and before you buy anything you would rebuild that emergency fund it becomes game you know it becomes uh, job one to not knock that emergency fund back out to top it back out again as quickly as you can so if you can do it reasonably quick uh, without stopping baby step four, I'm fine with that when it's been dipped into uh, because of that. But if it's a big hit on the thing, you, you need that emergency fund in place. I don't want you to get hit and then get hit again and not have any money because you're putting money into the 401k. That's not a plan. So you see what I'm talking about. It's all about risk and ratios, and that's what we're looking at here. So. Hey, good question, Justin. Thank you for following us on Twitter. This is the Dave Ramsey Show. It is all about risk and ratios. Yes. Let me tell you here, my 401k retirement plan uh, fits in my scheme of things to worry about right now. Yep, 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 yep. My 401k retirement plan and my emergency contingency plan. Yes, we all must, uh, uh, we all must weigh those risks and ratios thinking about our emergency contingency plans. I suggest you get out there and uh, develop your own emergency contingency plan while you still can and uh, I'm in investigating my emergency contingency plan. It looks like an absolutely gorgeous day here in the uh, spectacularly gorgeous day here in the end times in paradise and the Finger Lakes until you realize it is 51 degrees with a wind chill factor I think somewhere in the mid 40s uh, today but we got three days of rain coming and then they promise they promise starting on Friday just in time for Sandy's visit it is going to be spectacularly gorgeous here in upstate New York as far as the eye can see, if we can just make it till Friday without slitting our wrists. Bye, guys.